morning and welcome to the first episode of I'm a Scout, Get Me Out. Over the next two days we will be broadcasting live, or nearly live, from our secret jungle camp. All the competitors are ready, the crew are ready, the animals are ready. We've been practicing our lines for months so we can guarantee there'll be no slip ups. Um, uh, there are three camps in our jungle, Camp Dingo, Camp Wombat and Camp Wallaby. Each camp has 10 scouts, each hoping to be crowned king or queen of the jungle. They'll compete over a series of 10 challenges to earn stars for themselves and their team. But most importantly, every change will decide their camp's next meal. Will they win a luxury breakfast of eggs, bacon, sausages, cereals, breads and chocolate spread, orange juice and tea, or coffee? All served to them in the swanky Kappa Cafe. Or if they come second in a challenge, they'll win a nice meal for breakfast that might mean bacon butties, but they'll have to cook for themselves on a proper fire. Or maybe, if they come last in a challenge, they'll win for their team a basic meal of, for breakfast. This might be porridge and water. This camp has very strict rules. Banned items include mobile phones, food and sweets. Anyone caught smuggling these items in will have them confiscated and and the whole team will lose Sorry, points. Hello? In fact, hello? these two things are so strict that there's even the J1 oh, yeah. count. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, excuse me, hello? Oh yes, Dominic Pizza. Can you deliver it round the back, please? Thank you. Our first challenge is Mystery Sludge. Let's go over to the challenge now. Hello and welcome to Mystery Sludge. This challenge involves five scouts from each camp. Each team must find five balloons that contain stars and some sort of mystery sludge. They will take it in turns to run and burst one balloon with their mounted pin to their helmet. They collect the stars and return to the start where the helmet is swapped over and the next person goes. At this point I should say that they will be doing this blindfolded. Their teammates will, be shout, will shout out instructions to help them find the balloons. The winning team will be the team who collects the five balloons in the shortest time. The teams are playing for camp points and personal points. But more importantly, they are playing for a luxury supper. Let's go over to start now. So there we have it, challenge one, mystery slime, and I'm not talking about Kappa's porridge. A great win for Camp Dingoes, which earns them three camp points and puts them on the top of the leaderboard. Over the next few days, you'll be able to tune in and see your children complete challenges, camp, cook, light fires, chop wood, shoot, climb, and so much more. And at the end of the weekend, you'll get to take them home in a little smelly oven when you drop them off. And judge, judging by the look of Matthew, a little bit slimier too. Don't forget you can leave messages for your children on the Facebook page and we will follow them on. So that's it for this evening. The campmates from Dingo Camp are going to enjoy their luxury, luxury supper. Campmates from um, Wombat get 
a nice supper and camp mates from Wallaby get a basic supper. Oh, that's where all the extra time went. It's time for us to say goodbye now, but tune in tomorrow at breakfast where we'll <laughs> see how the camp mates got on on their first night in camp. And we'll also see how the other scouts did on their second challenge, shooting stars, to decide when who gets the luxury breakfast, who gets the basic breakfast. And who gets Kappa's mystery slime? Uh, I mean, lovely porridge. Presenting the winners, Thank you. the Wallabies with their stars, they go back to camp with a luxury breakfast waiting for them, they'll be waited on in Central. Welcome back to I'm a Scout Get Me Out on our third challenge, All a Quiver. We will have to hit targets with balloons and the winning camp will get a luxury lunch. So welcome to I'm a Scout. Get me out. It's the climbing challenge. Reach for the stars. First up, it's the dingoes with Flora and Eleanor and Ollie. The challenges are in nine stars on the cube, all with a word on. They have to write down the words, unscramble the sentence, and shout the answer in the fastest time. Their teammates are here, and they'll help them unscramble the sentence. Okay. Contestants, are you ready? Yeah. Timer, are you ready? ready. Belayers, are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> Three, two, one, climb! Oh, it's not how you Come on, guys. Well, has you can do it. oh, nice start there for Molly. Stop the clock. Well done, guys. Very good. Well done, Dingoes. Beautiful morning on Sunday. 
<laughs> Here's Holly, she's just about to enter Wallaby Camp, where they are starting a uh, firelighting challenge. Each patrol, each camp has been given a set amount of water, and they have to be the first camp to boil that water. So they've got to light a fire and boil that water. Holly's the judge, and we join Wallabies. Some Wallabies are still in bed. Morning. Morning, Wallabies. Morning, Wallabies. So there's three people doing this challenge. And you've got Owen, Tilly, and James. And they've already got the fire going. Very quickly. Very quickly got that fire going. Well done, Dean. Lucas. Cameron. Challenge. It's the first camp to boil a pint of water. Oh, yes. So that's perfect, yeah. Because then you can still. Imagine anything worse. Take a seat, guys. Take a seat.
might be the time to pan round. <laughs> pan round. You got it. You got it. You got it. Oh, you're king of the jungle and well done. Yeah. Do another little sweep after this. I'll do that. Oh, a nice crown there. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, and there's your jungle crown. <laughs> Congratulations. Oh, no. Congratulations. Looking good. Your, your Royal Highness ship. Right. <laughs> <laughs> 